One person is dead, a suspect in custody following a homicide investigation that launched a police pursuit. State police tell us a woman was shot on Scotty Street in Franklin at around 9 o'clock this morning. The suspect in that shooting led police on a chase spanning more than 100 miles, coming to an end on I-10 near Lacassine and Welsh. The interstate was shut down for an hour. While troopers say the man refused to leave the car, he was later taken into custody. Let's head out live to Franklin, where KTC's Jamie Angel spoke to neighbors near the initial scene. Jamie. Jim, investigators cleared the scene behind me about an hour ago, uh, and the community still feeling the effects. Uh, it has this neighborhood on edge. Female victim was located, 37-year-old. Um, um, at, at this time, we still have an active investigation going. We do have a person of interest in custody. Um, by another department, they were able to stop him and detain him. Franklin police responded early Monday to several calls of shots being fired in the area of Scotty and Pine Street. It was something like, I mean, unbelievable. I mean, just hadn't heard that in this area. Jackie Jackson was at home when she heard several gunshots right outside her house in Franklin. You heard it. And then it was a little while later, and then you heard it again. The gunfire so close, it pierced Jackson's fence and punctured her swimming pool. I mean, because, I mean, we could have been outside. I mean, sometimes you get up, I mean, tending to the pool, you know, putting the chemicals or something. And if somebody would have been outside, it could have been one of mine, you know. We are still waiting on identity of the, of the victim and the suspect in this situation. Uh, that suspect was taken into custody. Reporting live in Franklin, Jamie Angel, KETC, TV3. Back to you guys.